Uh, you know about Kohari? Hmm. Huh. Just that? I, I, I thought there'd be more text there. Uh, oh, oh. I can use that. Yeah. Mm, it's quite close. Is there no... No, let's continue here a bit. <laughs> There's probably a path that would lead me there. Shouldn't there be miners around? Oh, there's a piece of gold here. stuff hmm. oh yeah I didn't let's get those first Wobbly fang a hard sharp fang obtained from Wobbly still it with a creature to make an elixir or attach to a narrow to increase its attack power and blue Wobbly horn a large curved horn with two extremely hard tips attached to a weapon to moderate increase its attack power or cook it with a creature to make an elixir Okay, that. A little blade. Hmm. A basic two handed sword, once wielded by Asper Adventures. It's K. Okay, it's a regular sword. Oh, yeah, I actually wanted to shoot that. <laughs> Bokoblin, these heavyweight monsters are leaders of Bokoblins, they've got more stamina than the red variety, and they execute powerful punches and weapon attacks. The horns on their heads are sharper too. Okay. Arrows, swords, prime meal. What did he drop? Oh. Blue boss becoming horn, an X shaped horn with a band to identify it as belonging to a leader. Attach it to a weapon to moderately increase attack power or cook your creatures to make the elixir. Stone two handed axe. Uh, it's from her state. This heft weapon knocks out many a foe. The cade is still packs a punch and is great for breaking rocks. Yeah, but that's the description of the... Uh, what was the name? Boulder Breaker? What's the second one? Stone Cobber, I guess. Mm, yeah, that doesn't seem to be a proper path to this one. Open up there. Can I rewind that? No. Oh, what a bother. Uh, did you come out to see this cable tower? Sorry, everything around here is a bit of a mess. A mess? A big chunk of old ruins fell from the sky and hit the cable tower. Mm. It knocked off the lid that covers the hole at the top of the tower. 
That means the hole at the top is open. And that's not all. After the impact, the door got stuck too. Ah. Let's see. Maybe if you use the terminal inside, that would force the door back open. But without a way to get inside, we're kind of stuck. Okay. Hmm. Expect a quest. Hmm. You're not really rewinding. I think I don't have that. Sunshroom, a bright red mushroom that grows in hot climates. Imbued with the power of heat, it can be used to cook dishes that will allow you to endure the bitter cold. Mm, if I could go below, maybe I could dive up. That's the kind of thing I was looking for. Oh, a star folded. A star folded fell there. Oh, and that's probably the yeah. That's the next one I need. Yeah, I'll jump there after getting the top. How oh, convenient. Hmm, <laughs> there's probably a bunch falling here. Quite close. I didn't pay attention. Is this the guy that was there with Robbie? Oh, Ooh, I was right. His internal did open the door. Thank you. That was big help. Oh. Now then, I think I'll take a little break before heading to my next job, which would be... Salsa. If you have fun, you can take a breather. The construction company is short on staff, which is a pain. That must be rough. Oh. That's right, it's definitely rough. I, can I tell you about it? If it's not a long story? Oh. I recently took a job as a carpenter for a company called Hudson Construction. At first, things were great, everyone was real nice, really nice, and my boss taught me the basics and everything. Uh... But the day her castle floated up, all sorts of things changed. Work started rolling in, it was endless. I've, we've been busy ever since. They've sent us new carpenters to check the Skyhill Towers in each region. But there are only three of us doing that. Ah. Uh, this work's going to keep us out in, in the field, away from our company for a long time. <laughs> I mean, good to keep the towers running, that's something at least. Uh, look at me, got away from myself there. That's not like me at all. Oh. Hey mister, I guess it was a whole long thing in the end, sorry, thanks for hearing me out. Oh, oh okay. I think I can glide to the next tower from here. If my stamina allows. Surf's map of Lady. Oh, this got the whole that mountain. Oh, there, there's no lava oh. at all. Only that? I expect more around that mountain. It's huge. Well, there's an island right here. Um, uh, another one like that. Okay, let's check here. 
Uh, nothing here. Oh. Did I get it? Yeah, smothering butterfly. The worst ones to get. Uh, this rare butterfly lives in volcanic regions. Its body contains a heat resistant liquid which can be turned into a topical elixir that offers resistance to flames. Mm, I could have used more pens. Yeah, let's use more things. Let's go back there. Okay. Mm, doesn't seem that much faster. Oh, I think killed some butterflies. Good. Another one. Oh, a mushroom. A rare yellowish orange mushroom. Cook it before eating to temporarily increase your stamina limit. Damage. Okay, those I can get, yeah. Okay. Form Darter. This dragonfly has a special organ that causes it to sweat profusely. Cook it with monster parts for an elixir that will raise your core temperature so you can resist the cold. But I don't have to hunt for that. The crystal. Look at the wonder shrine. Water makes a way. Hmm, love. Oh, we've never. Whoa, we've never. Put water on lava in the first game. Huh? Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, hang on, can I just grab that thing? Okay. No, maybe that's what I'm supposed to do because I actually thought I. I would have to carry those. Yeah, I can, but I that's what I thought I had to do at first. Um, Alright, now I'll have to pile them up. So here. Can I just keep doing that until the game freezes? So there's probably a limit for how many things I can merge. It can probably slow down the game, but I think it will take too long for me to actually bother the hardware. Can I climb it? Good. Strong construction ball. Uh, I think I have one. 
pas mon nom. Bon, laisse Euh... What the... No. Love is lag. Uh. Okay. Do I have? Oh, only that. Oh. 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 So let's surge. Ooh, no damage. Really? Surge. Oh, damn. Maybe Impa would be around and tell me about it. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. Let's just. It is quite an interesting device. This is definitely not from this era. That said, I believe there may be a way to get the travel functionality working here. Hmm. I'd like to tinker with it a bit. Would it be okay if I borrow it? Yes, whatever you need. I really appreciate your help. Then I'll hold on to it. So you really believe my story? That I came from the future? I never doubted you for a moment. 
Minoru, do you know of a way we could help to return Zelda back to her time? I suspect it was the power of your secret stone that allowed you to travel through time. To put it simply, secret stones amplify the power their owners possess. I am able to separate my spirit from my body. Raru can repel or destroy evil with his power of light. And Sonia, she can control time. As for you, I can sense both light and time powers. Mm. But your secret stone seems to amplify your time power. Time power? Ultimately, the secret stone only amplifies your power. It doesn't suddenly grant you mastery and control. That's still up to you. That means... If you don't already know how to get yourself home... <sighs> there are stories about the secret stones and... a forbidden act called Draconification. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon. One blessed with eternal life. <gasps> Interesting. Another way to reach the future. Though not a very quick one. Oh, so, so you think the these problem. stories could hint at a solution to our dilemma? Yes. But there is still more to those tales. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. That is why it is forbidden. I thought maybe this could lead to a solution. Some way to transcend time. But if you have to sacrifice your heart and mind, sacrifice what makes you, you. I'm sorry. I wish I could help more. <laughs> oh, back where we started. There's still hope. I think the answer, the answer to this problem lies in study and learning more about the nature of your power. I'm sure Sonya would be happy to help you. Okay. okay. I got a later cutscene, but with that we could know that she got this stone from Ganondorf, so Ganondorf took the stone from Sonya and she probably would die. Uh, and those are tears that Zeld the dragon up, up there dropped. And that's why we get to see her memories. Cool. Oh, uh, Mirror's console. Okay, what's the next one? It's kind of like a fish, a whale. Let's go back to up there. Battery is on a device that holds concentrated is on a charge energy used to provide temporary power for other Zona devices. Hydrant is on a device that gushes water when struck. According to legend, Sky Islands saw water shortages long ago but became lush and fertile thanks to this technology. But well, where does it get the water from? Big Wheel, a power Zona device that wants to move. It's a big, mean wheel that excels at tearing through environments that might challenge smaller wheels. It can handle shallow water. Okay, there's that island over there. Ah, uh, but like before. Uh huh. Batteries. Mm, yeah, there's not really much point going there if I can't translate that.
Oh no, I don't have infinite bombs to toss those guys. Wow, this is the first software I can find. Rock Octorok. This octopus-like species of monster lives in volcanic regions. When they inhale, they are prepared to spit out of flaming rocks. Be aware of their powerful suction. <laughs> Octoballoon. This inflatable Octorok organ has a lot of lift, so attached to items you want to see float. A arrow can serve as a good way to stick one to a distant object. Oh, cool. Uh, Bedrock Bistro in Goro City. Oh, the Goro eating bad stuff. You're traveling alone? I don't recommend it for a highland especially. Ah. This may sound strange coming from a Goro, but this really ought to but you really ought to stay away from Goro City right now. Cook, who's normally a nice fella, has been turning Highlands away from his bistro. And all the workers over at Yonoboko have been slacking off and eating these weird rocks. I heard things had gotten bad at home, so I rushed back. I didn't pay attention. Is this the guy that was lost? Turns out everything I've been hearing was true. Huh. Oh. There's a strange cake. Oh. Okay. Okay, uh, they are probably affected by gloom differently than humans. The marble rock roast is sold out here. This is the last of the last. Mm -hmm. What is your Noboko doing then? They better get on it and dig up more pronto. Oh. Digging up marble rock roast is your job. Come on, cut this out. Mm. Once I finish this marble rock roast, I'm heading to Gorm City to buy more. To go get the rupees together. Mm. Big bro, you always wanted to be part of your Noboko. And you finally got in, but now you're just sitting here munching. Uh, you may not want to go to that restaurant over there. You probably shouldn't go to Gone City either. Ever since the Marble Rock Rose showed up, everyone's been acting funny. <sighs> Big Bro was so happy to get into Yonoboko, but now it's like he doesn't even care. He's like a stranger to me, Yonoboko. Yeah, you know, the team that digs up ore around here and sells it and stuff. Big Bro was always feeling proud about the growth in Goro City, saying it's all thanks to Noboko, but ever since they started selling marble rocks, marble rock rolls, the whole city has been feeling weird. Mm. Yeah, they are the yummy rocks that Noboko sells, they are like everywhere. You can find them in caves around here, kinda all over the place lately. Everyone says they're super tasty. But they're so hard and crunchy that us kids and elders can't eat them. Our teeth can handle that crunch. Kinda the same thing, different situation, but the children are in charge like in Rito Village. Not even his eyes look the same anymore. It's like he was never my big bro at all. Or We'll fix this. Is it possible? No, oh, no, I don't think I have a picture of that one in Blaze and Shield. Oh. Look, I'm sorry I wasted it. But asking me to bring you another marble rock, rock meat roast marble rock roast isn't reasonable uh, how about this instead mm. these mysterious things were only discovered after the people it looks a little strange I know but it's a hard curio to come by uh? 
Barber Rock Roast is in short supply and high demand around here. Everyone wants it. I've barely been keeping up. Letting your hottest commodity go to waste is unforgivable. You can make up for it by bringing me a fresh Barber Rock Roast. Now get that thing out of my sight. If I was able to get you some, I clearly have done it by now. I checked out the caves past the car tracks, just like you told me, I couldn't get anything. Aww. You know places like that are way too dangerous for a hiding like me. Aww. Not my problem, I don't want that hunk of junk. I'm gonna I'm not letting you off the hook till you get me a marble rock roast. And why do you have to work for him? Can I take it? Oh. Hey, you might, that's fine. Mm. Uh, where are your gardens always this thick? Anyway, you slice it, this is worth more than one marble rock roast. Guess I got no choice but to try those escape past the car tracks again. Mm. But how am I supposed to get past the lava? Mm. What, another Hylian? No search for Hylians right now, no exceptions. You can blame this guy, he went and let a precious marble rock rose go to waste. Mm. So until somebody brings me a marble rock rose, I'm not offering nothing to Hylians. Marble rock rose, mm. uh, yes, marble rock rose. Uh, best thing since sliced rock. Uh, it is the most delectable of rocks crucial to our survival. I laid car tracks to the caves so we'd be able to pull a big hole of it. But now the delivery guy is slacking off, so it's real hard to come by. Anyway, I've got nothing to feed you behind this with, so scram. Okay, why are you looking at him? <laughs> Hello. Uh, I'm here for Cook's famous culinary concoctions too. Recently I heard about a rare delicacy being offered here known as Marble Rock Roast. I'm told it's indescribable. Uh, I interrupted my travels to come try it, but they're fresh out. Not sure edible rocks would appeal to a Hylian though. Too much tooth crunch. Uh, normally there's a menu just for Hylians, but everything is sold out on, the, on that one as well. Seems like we're both out of luck, huh? Don't worry, my good sir. I'll, I'll bring you before serving that guy. Uh, no cards? Big deal having cracks if we don't have cards. This is probably more like the the death mountain we found on any other game that we can endure climbing it. Fire Choo Choo, this low level gel monster is engulfed in flames, its strength varies depending on its size. It tends to explode if attacked from close range, so the use of spears, arrows and other range of apples is advised. Timawak. Strike. Against the flow. Huh. Huh. Oh, it makes longer platforms as well.
That's a mess. Strong's on the shield. Okay. Just the one. I think only more shrines so far had two. I floats. Okay, this seems more common here than it was in Breath of the Wild. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more. Uh, I'm supposed to bring it from. Uh, okay. Uh. Ah, oh, good. I can't climb that, can I? <laughs> no. Uh, come on. This works. I'm just a bit afraid it's it thing it tries to sink. While I'm on it, uh, why is it turning? Why is it turning? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, don't do that. Yeah, it'll probably be better to just use the hydrant and make a bridge while I was walking. Come on, why are you turning? Why is it turning? It didn't work as I wanted. Reminders for Hylion workers. You'll need fire resistance in the cave. If you run out of fireproof elixir, make more with fireproof lizards and monster parts. When bathing, try dipping all the way in up to your shoulders. If injured while working, quickly report to your Naboko HQ in the North Mine. Yeah. 
this restaurant cave. Wow, already. Okay, I found a few, so let's fire it up. Yeah, I got plenty. Not those. So, mm, most of parts. Mm, mm, yeah, that's for each. I'm not gonna use that. Oh, oh, I don't have that many. I'm not gonna use that on arrows. Oh. Oh, fireproof elixir, flame guard, nine minutes. Brings fireproof effect, which prevents your body from catching fire. Be sure to pack this when invading out to explore caves in Death Mountain. Okay, let's make another good one like that. If there's a shrine or something down there, I'm a waste some of that time. Let's say one to go, one to come back, and want to be safe uh, uh, I don't have any heat resistance codes no not yet. Oh, my shoe. Hmm, both. Okay. Uh, that's why I didn't have the cart yet. But I'll probably have to return with the... Uh, what's the name? Marbles, rock rose. Oh, poor guy. Oh, I've never... Oh, it doesn't even hurt me. Oh, no, I feel bad. It's just... I'm just scared that I'm shooting arrows at it. check the map. But I don't think I exactly killed the bull bullfrog. I think maybe if a bloopy it's enough uh, rupees it turns into a bubble frog. And maybe if it's more rupees it turns into a satori. From what you quoting said it seems like no, yeah, just take that and bring back. Okay. From what Colton said, I think they just. Oh, yeah, let's take more. Uh, I think there are more than ones there. So. They're just larger blue piece. Oh, come on, cards. Uh, no, I'm a bit afraid. I'm a bit afraid to get a bone flower here. Oh, well. 
the worst that can happen is we die. Yeah. <laughs> Just me, I'm dead. So, mm -mm. yeah. Oh, why am I? Oh, damage. I removed. I didn't care about that effect. Farkis eyeball. Farkis eyeballs are imbued with heat and are useful in making elixirs. Attach one to one arrow to grant a homing quality to the arrow. No, oh, I didn't jump. Turn that off. Okay, let's. No. No. You want to try it? Here for you. Uh. Hey, that's ah. now that's a marble rock roast. Hey, you, that marble rock roast. Would you trade it for this? <laughs> Thanks, I own you. Ah. Hey, chef, uh, this makes a square. So long as I've got marble rock rose, I got no complaints. Mm -hmm. Phew, help me out out of buying there. You see, uh, I'm a meat man. When I heard this place serve rose to die for, I came running. Little did I know, the meat here is actually rocks. <laughs> This isn't meat or a rock, but it's the rarest thing I own. Take it with my thanks. Okay. Ah. Oh, before you go, have you heard about the rumor beast? Beast? If that creature's really out there, I'm gonna find out if it's edible. When you love meat, that's just what you do. The satori? Figure I'll hit the stables to ask around for leads. Ah. By the way, we're not strangers anymore, buddy. If you see me out there in the wilds, give me a shout. Okay, miser. I'll try to remember you. Until then, take care. Tasting the food is part of a chest brain work, you know? So, until I'm done tasting this here marble rock rose. Uh, the joint is closed. That includes anything on the higher menu. Mm. But uh, I can take it. No, I, I can't take it. Okay, so I guess we're done for here. For now. Let's keep going to Girl City. Oh, I didn't have to choose. I guess. Ah, 
Oh uh, yes, there's oh, there's a car over here. Oh, where's your friends? Oh, my friend, I got sprayed. Oh, my friend says more signal. Uh, yeah, big deal when you wheels and. Thanks, <laughs> my friend. Good. <laughs> 